Get somebody! Please! Call backup! Ah, oh, makes sense. What does it? The operation? These orders. What are we doing here when we should be part of the team bagging the primary objective? Hell if I know. But the orders came from Ice Queen Grim and she sits on the right. Mother! Haven't lost the touch. Sam, we have an opportunity here. Reed stashed Vice President Samson in the ballroom with personal bodyguards. He's waiting to be introduced as the next president. He's on my route to the West Wing. Pay him a visit. Then meet me in the press room. We'll figure out how to tackle Reed right there. Two kills confirmed. No survivors. He was tweaked for strike. Let me assert my firm belief that the only... Some of us want my contact. No sign of the hostile! What the hell was Reed thinking? What happens to his special plan if I catch a stray bullet? Mr. Vice President. Oh, Reed. Ow! Where's that? <laughs> Neatness counts. I scraped pig shit off my shoes. It was smarter than you, Fisher. You didn't run. Smart. <laughs> you don't get it, do you? You can't touch me. I got protection. I'm Teflon. So whatever you think you're going to do to me, Mr. Has been, Mr. Rogue Agent, Mr. Washed Up Spy, we well, can forget about it right now, because I'm bulletproof. Goddamn bulletproof here. Oh, really? Oh, oh, you shot me! Oh, you know, oh, you need to work on that whole bulletproof a thing. Bitch! Oh, oh, God, it hurts. Fix 
Go, go. Can't see the target. Almost bit off more than I could chew. By the time Grimm got a hold of Sam, Reed's men were kicking in the Oval Office door. She was there, and she could see that the President's protective detail was going down. The plan was for Sam to meet with Grimm in the press room where they'd figure out what the hell to do next. Of course, Grimm already had a plan, one she hadn't bothered to tell Sam about. But that shouldn't have surprised him. Some things, and some people, just don't change. <laughs> 